I'd love to welcome Labor Lion to the stage. Go get him, man. <coughs> Hello. My name is Bryce Bjork, and I'm the founder of Labor Lion. Imagine it's a Friday afternoon, and all you want to do is go home and hang out with the people that you love, your family. But you come home and you see on your to-do list this, or this, or maybe even this. What if I told you that right now you could complete all of those jobs just like that? and also support a local high school student. We are Labor Lion, a service that connects students and homeowners for household tasks. Tony is a father of three with a wife and a dog. He works super hard, and the last thing that he wants to do when he gets home are household chores. Right now, Tony has no good option. He's either outsourcing to expensive professionals and wasting money, doing the jobs himself and wasting time that he could otherwise be spending with his family, or the jobs just aren't getting done. I'm a student with a busy academic, athletic, and extracurricular schedule. I could not commit to a traditional high school job but I still wanted a disposable income. My solution was knocking on my neighbor's doors and asking if I could complete household jobs for money. I did everything from mowing lawns, to organizing basements, to weeding gardens, everything and anything between. I made working at household jobs my primary source of income. And in doing so, I noticed some flaws. As a student, you cannot compare these local jobs. You can't compare on the basis of price, time, or difficulty. But more importantly, you really don't know how to find them. I saw these problems on the side of Tony, and I saw my personal problems, and I decided to create a solution. I built for my community a website where homeowners post jobs and students respond to jobs. Very simple. The cool thing, it worked. Labor Lion was making over $500 a month. I then went to Catapult, where a team of three extremely passionate students joined Labor Lion. These students had experienced these problems for themselves and were passionate about finding a solution. We conducted a comprehensive investigation of Labor Lion from the ground up. We learned that 80% of homeowners would rather hire a local high school student than a stranger. And that 60% of students were just like me and eager to complete these household jobs. We surveyed the, the market and we conducted this comprehensive investigation. We got some really important customer feedback and began developing our next iteration of Labor Lion. We call the next version Labor Lion 2.0. It's a mobile application with a supplementary website that manages the connection between the student and the homeowner, the completion of the job, and the job payment. Labor Lion 2.0 operates on a transaction fee model. Almost every homeowner that we talked to said that they would rather pay a small amount after the job is completed than a monthly subscription. We compete with companies like TaskRabbit and HomeJoy. However, we differentiate ourselves on our use of the latent student workforce. Because we use students, we're extremely cost effective. The average hourly wage of a student is $12 an hour. 
If you tried to hire a professional handyman via TaskRabbit, you'd pay 40 or 50. We are also different because we're community centric. Using LaborLion is hiring the students that live in your neighborhood right down the street. Let's talk about the market. There are 37,000 high schools in the United States alone, which equates to about 15 million high school students. The market is huge. But how are we going to penetrate this market? We plan to use community-based student advocates who will earn a commission on the jobs that they help facilitate. We estimate that based on our financial model, these community-based student advocates can make about $4,000 per community that they help establish. That's more money than as a student you'll be making doing traditional jobs or household jobs. That's a lot of money for a student. We know that this model is going to work because we did it ourselves. My team and I went into our respective communities and connected manually homeowners and students for job completion. We took 20% of the job payment and proved that students are comfortable and homeowners are comfortable with this kind of model. We believe that because we could establish labor line in our communities as students, that students nationwide can do the same. Three months from now, we plan to launch the application in the two communities where labor line is flourishing. And six months from now, we plan to expand and iterate on our student advocacy program. We know that we can get there, but we'd like your help. Today, we're looking for individuals or organizations that can help us with introductions to developers and can help us with expansion and sales expertise. LaborLine is positioned to revolutionize student labor and household work nationwide. We invite you to join us and help connect the Tonys and the students like me nationwide. Thank you.